Video number 11, step 7, advertise your product. Something extremely important for you to get success promoting any offer is the quality of the traffic you send to that offer. You could be promoting the greatest product ever, but if you send one million horrible quality visitors to your offer, you will be wasting all of your money, time, and effort. Do not let other people deceive you. Now you'll see a really nice list of traffic getting methods you can use, as well as where to get them. Pay per click. Pay per click, or PPC, is a form of internet advertising that directs traffic to a website, and the advertiser then pays the website owner when someone clicks on the ad. So instead of bidding on keywords relevant to their target audience, the PPC displays, which are usually some sort of banner ad, which is placed into either search engine results or some other sort of website that has content that is related to the item for sale in the ad. Pay per call. Pay per call is a type of performance based advertising somewhat similar to pay per click. The difference is that instead of there being a fee for each click, the business must pay their service provider a fee for each call when the customer calls the connected phone number. Email newsletter. Email newsletters are updates that a business sends out to customers who have signed up to receive various notices from that business. They're sent out on a regular basis and could include tips, facts, savings, and special offers. Some include HTML hyperlinks to go to the business website for more information. The content is written by a copywriter and the newsletter is designed by a graphic designer. Solo ads. Solo ads are an email-centered advertising method that works through a system two marketers have agreed upon that is used to reach the subscribers to the program. The internet marketer sends out emails to the subscribers on the behalf of the other marketer in order to show their offer or ads. It usually has between eight and ten lines of text. Podcasting. Podcasting is a method of sending out audio files via RSS. It's done just like any other RSS feed, except that the feed subscribed to is an audio one instead of a text feed. The resulting podcast can be listed on a website by a clickable link. Traffic agencies. Traffic agencies are services that create, plan, and manage advertising and other promotions for their patrons. They can also handle marketing and branding plans for their clients. SEO Organic Search Engine Optimization, or SEO, is the process of affecting the visibility of a website or a web page in a search engine's natural or unpaid, organic, search results. In general, the earlier or high ranked on the search results page, and the more frequently a site appears in the search results list, the more visitors it will receive from the search engine's users. SEO may target different kinds of searches, including image search, local search, video search, academic search, news search, and industry-specific vertical search engines. As an internet marketing strategy, SEO considers how search engines work, what people search for, the actual search terms or keywords typed into search engines, and which search engines are preferred by their targeted audience. Optimizing a website may involve editing its content, HTML, and associated coding to both increase its relevance to the specific keywords and to remove barriers to the indexing activities of search engines. Promoting a site to increase the number of backlinks or inbound links is another SEO tactic. Affiliate Networks An affiliate network is a kind of middleman between the affiliate and the affiliate program merchant. It lets the website owner find affiliate programs to join to put the items for sale on their websites. The affiliate network lets the merchants give the website owners a share of the profits generated by the sale of the affiliate products. Banner media. Banners that employ images, text, sound, and video. Sometimes they are also interactive between the customer and the advertiser. That is, asking the customer to play a game, go to certain pages, etc. It uses technology like Flash, Java, JavaScript, and DHTML. CPA Media Cost per action, or CPA, is a type of Internet advertising pricing model in which the advertiser must pay for every stated act, such as submitting a form, signing up for a newsletter, making a sale, etc. The advantage is that the advertiser only has to pay for the ad if the requested act happens. Social Media 
Social media is a type of interaction between people where they generate, share, or exchange data, pictures, etc. via sites such as Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, Google+, LinkedIn, etc. Mobile. Mobile marketing is a type of marketing where the advertiser sends out the ads to a person's mobile device, that is, a smartphone or other internet-capable device. Mobile marketing provides patrons with all kinds of information on the advertiser's goods, services, coupons, etc. It has become a very popular advertising medium since many people own mobile phones. Content syndication. Content syndication is a type of syndication where the content is available for other users and websites to access. This may be done via web feeds, forums, etc. It's also a kind of licensing for website content to allow other websites to use the same material. Retargeting. Retargeting is a type of cookie-based technology using JavaScript code to secretly follow your customer's browsing habits on the Internet. The website puts a cookie or pixel on the website, which is a piece of coding, and when a new visitor to your site goes on to the website, it activates the cookie. This shows you what type of places they go, so you can generate specific ads towards them. Video. Video is a type of advertising where short video content is compiled to send out either on the web or to mobile devices. The nature of these advertisements comes in several different forms and can be used for information, entertainment, how-to, or sales opportunities. Offline media. Offline media is the traditional form of advertising, such as newspapers, flyers, or any type of advertising that's not going out over the Internet or over any sort of broadcast media like TV or radio. Traffic exchanges. A traffic exchange is a website that provides website owners with some type of service in exchange for their getting traffic. The website gets transmissions from website owners when they join traffic exchange networks. Then, the one who submitted the website must browse other members' sites listed on the network to get credits, and those credits allow their websites to get seen by other network members. This, in turn, helps all of the signed-up sites get more traffic, and thus, possibly more profits. RSS directories. RSS directories are comparable to website directories. However, they have lists of RSS feeds instead of lists of various websites. An RSS feed contains full text or a summary, as well as metadata, such as a publishing date and the name of the writer. Subscribing to one makes it so that the user is informed of any updates to the list of articles. I just can't finish this section without telling you where you can find all kinds of services. It's just crazy. But here you can find almost anything you might be looking for online, and only for $5. Yep, I'm talking about Fiverr.com. Please check out this URL right here to know more about that.